Hey, good morning, how do you do? We've got something special for you. It's just for fun, it's just for kids. Time for the city touching. Uh, number six, if you're a guy on the dating apps uh, and you're looking to make a connection, stop it with all the sports talk. Yeah, it's a come huge on. turn off. According to a recent study, women would rather hear you talk about travel or music mm. than sports. Mm. And they prefer getting a coffee rather than meeting oh, at a bar. Oh, would you stop with these generalizations? And it's okay to mention fitness and That's working right. out as long as it's not obsessive. If you're not getting any good matches on the apps, you might want to try finding love in the stands watching your favorite team oh, play. Oh, that's a good idea. Or yeah. just don't listen to any of this because people like different things. So there yeah. might be someone yeah. who likes the sports. Right. And it Take it from someone who's been successful in love. <laughs> you tell them. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> that's right. Huh? Yeah, go sports. <laughs> Number five, uh, if you're a swimmer, these are the goggles for you. Robin, listen up. Smart Swim 2 goggles are equipped with motion sensor detectors. Whoa. They track all your movements, every stroke. They use uh, data to calculate stroke rate, stroke count, heart rate. They also keep track of distance and pace. Wow. The data is overlaid into the lens, so it allows you full time to access your swim numbers if you pay attention to the tiny screen in the corner. They also connect to your smartphone device, so you can keep track of everything you do. Yeah, what? but do they, do they not? Not fog up. That's the yeah. only question I have. Yeah. Fog up. Give me a headache. That crap is useless. All right. Uh, wow, we. Surprisingly, I wouldn't put those to my. You don't juice. like going underwater, right? Well, and I'm not You're swimming. You're underwater. I'm not. If I do, it's just for a quick dunk to rinse Little, my hair. I'm not yeah. setting any records or chair tracking how fast yeah. it's happening. Yeah. Larry wants you to see how long you can hold your breath. <laughs> That's the record he's <laughs> right. to Let me help you. <laughs> All right, number four. More and more Gen Zers are ditching their smartphones for flip phones. Oh. According to consumer experts, they're realizing how addicting it is to scroll on TikTok and Instagram all day, so they're Good choosing plan. something simpler. And flip phones don't allow all the apps. They're simply there to communicate the old-fashioned way via call or text. But if you tried to text yeah, on a flip phone, not easy. Yeah, you can't do it. That's what's the beauty of it, too. Other reasons why young people like flip phones? It's a style thing. Sure. They're all about the Y2K fashion, and the flip phones are a nod to the early 2000s. Not just that, Gen Zers say they're also good conversation starters at parties and bars. Yeah, yeah, there, there is some truth to that. Like yeah. my son, when he's in trouble, gets a flip phone, <laughs> and like he becomes the most popular guy in school. Everyone's like, show me that phone. <laughs> Let's see that. It's fascinating. Yeah. And coming up at 9 o'clock, I have things you might not know about every generation that I tracked oh, down okay. because I couldn't ah. think of a list. Right. And so I'm that's my list today. I today at 8.30. <laughs> you might learn something. Yeah. All, right. All right. All right, number three, ever wonder why your cat follows you into the bathroom? Well, cat scientists have a few theories. First theory is cats uh, have a thing with water. Uh, they like the motion of running water or the way light reflects off of it. And if a human is interacting with it, that's even more intriguing to some cats. If they're pawing at the door, it may be a sign of guarding. Uh, your cat could be uh, protective of you, and the running water or the flushing toilets are potential hazards, uh, at least from your cat's uh, perception. Yeah, this is a lot. Or they're plotting your demise yeah. because yeah. they're cats. <laughs> yeah. Number two, the weather's getting warmer. You know what that means. Sun's out, toes out. There we Here go. we are. Unless you're at work. Too much yeah. toe cleave. <laughs> Stop. Or toe cleavage. Oh my God. Might be considered a little. These are beautiful. Those are nice toes. Really nice. Even for the office said that they're okay with the casual. This is still not good. A few toes peeping out of a shoe won't harm anyone, yeah. but exposing too much foot can be considered unprofessional and unsanitary. Oh, yeah. Rules, rules. If you do plan to show off those toes, make sure they're polished, How clean, and professional looking. Janky toes won't cut it. No time for a pedicure. <laughs> Excuse me. Keep yeah. them covered. Yeah. <laughs> All right, number one, we're looking at some of the most downloaded songs of the 20th century. Yesterday, we gave you Queen. Oh, that was right. number five most yes. downloaded right, song, I believe. All right, well, guess what? Queen's on the list again. What? I'm a shooting star leaping through the sky Like a tiger defying the laws of gravity I'm a racing car passing by Stop. 
Anyway, downloaded more than 1.1 billion wow. times. Great song. Yeah. Uh. It's a jammer. Yeah. <laughs> That's the six at six. There yes, we go. Indeed it is. Scott! Anytime she's